bumblebeezies. Happy Monday. Good morning. Happy Monday. And happy birthday to this beautiful <laughs> woman here. Thank you. Happy 40 years old. 40 Thank years you. young. Thank you. Yes, it's my birthday today, you guys. I can't believe I'm 40. <laughs> I'm 40 years old. Um, but anyways, it's early. It's 624 right now. And we are on our way to get some acai bowls for breakfast. We're gonna go to the Sunrise Shack, which is over at the, is it at the Outrigger? Yeah. It's just next to the Moana Surf Rider. So we're just gonna walk, it's not far. But I did bring my rain jacket because it's like 50% chance that it's gonna rain most of the day today. But it's okay. Um, a little rain never hurt. Won't stop us from having fun today especially today on my birthday. Mm -hmm. Also, I'm vlogging on my phone because I didn't want my camera to get wet in case if it does rain. All right, let's go. Here's the pool. It's really pretty. So yeah, we just have to walk through here then get to the street, turn right, and then it's just like a block down. The sun isn't even up yet, you guys. And here we are, going to get acai bowls. It's very nice out here right now, actually. All right, guys, this was literally right across the street from our hotel. I didn't even think it was that close. I thought it was at least another block, but it's right across. And that's where we're going tonight, right? Hula Girl? Hula Grill, I keep saying girl. And here's the Sunrise Shack. Here's the menu. Superfood smoothie bowls. I'm gonna get the acai bowl. They have tropical bowl, monkey bowl, blue dream bowl, junga matcha bowl. There's the prices. So I'm gonna get the acai bowl, it's $11.95. But then I'm gonna do medium, so it's an extra dollar fifty. They have some merchandise like t-shirts and hats super cute there's little tote bags it's like so cute you guys there's more over here so here is my acai bowl papa bear got the same exact one it looks so good you guys oh my goodness all right guys we're all done with our breakfast at the sunrise track it's her birthday it's, it's her my birthday. birthday okay so the acai bowl was good. I give it probably like an 8 out of 10. But honestly, the Island Vintage Coffee acai bowl is better. That one is like a 9 out of 10. Yeah. But they're know. both good. Yeah. They're both good, but I think Island Vintage, like when I tried their acai bowl here, or uh -huh. the acai, I was like... Yeah, oh. the actual like smoothie part, yeah. the, the Island Vintage Here's has a better good. smoothie, yeah. We're gonna take advantage of the weather since it's not raining at the moment. <laughs> We're gonna go walk down the beach, go visit Uncle Duke. Here he is. How's it, Uncle Duke? Uncle Duke. We were well. Papa Bear was watching a video on the airplane about him and his history and everything yeah, about it's his surf. Waterman. Waterman, all yeah. about his surfing and everything. Yeah. yeah. If you guys can find that online, I recommend watching it. Because he was telling me about it. It sounds really good. Yeah, it was really nice. Just the type of person he was. Yeah. And, uh, uh, he was in Australia one time. One quick story. He was in Australia surfing. And uh, <clears throat> they saw this boat capsize and turn over. And he went out there. And I think there was probably about 10 passengers or something like that. He rescued the eight that... Uh, that were that were still alive but the four that were um that had passed in the water he went back and brought them in he didn't leave them out there so yeah to show that aloha spirit that you know even though you know you're you're not here anymore and you're out in the water he didn't want you to just be out there he, yeah, he grabbed he you for back. your family and your friends and to have closure so that was one of the big keys of that documentary that you know that really touched you, yeah, huh? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's Just really the type good. of man he was and the low spirit he showed everywhere and you know. So. Uncle Duke. Look, there's already people out here surfing. Oh yeah, waiting.
we're gonna head back to the room. We're gonna hang out there for a little bit. I need to finish my video from yesterday and then we will start getting ready. And today's plan is North Shore. We wanna try a different shrimp truck this time. Last time we did Giovanni's, so today we're gonna go Jenny's shrimp truck. And then we're gonna go to the Dole Plantation after that. And then that'll be it for like the morning afternoon. And then tonight, Papa Bear is taking me to dinner. So I'm excited for that. We're in the little store downstairs. This one's not an ABC store, but it's like an ABC store. I think it's called Hawaiian Casuals. Yeah, kind of Hawaiian Casuals. Yeah, it's basically like an ABC store. These t-shirts are two for 28. This one's nice. Oh wait, this is ABC store. Look at the tags, they said ABC oh. store. Yeah. These dresses are super cute. Vanessa got, got this last time. Am I gonna get pearls? I don't know. We'll see. We are getting ready to head out to go to the North Shore. This is my outfit for just the first part of the day. I'm going to change my clothes later. But this um, tank I got at Walmart. These are Lululemon leggings. And then I just twisted my hair for now. But I'm going to redo it later when we go out for dinner. And then I'll change into like a dress and everything. So I'll show you guys my second outfit later. We're ready to go. Of course, you can't forget your rain jacket. We're not making that mistake again. Rain jacket has to come wherever we go. And then this is the purse that I brought on this trip. I don't think I showed you guys, but my Louis Vuitton pochette Matisse. This is my favorite purse. You ready? Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and here's Papa Bear. Handsome Papa Bear. That's his rain jacket. It's from Old Navy. It's very nice. It's lightweight. Has a hood. I like it. Here comes my ride. I love my Uber driver. He's so handsome. <laughs> okay, let's go guys. So we decided to come to the Dole Plantation first. So that's where we're at right now. They do have like a maze here and they have a train ride, but they said the train ride wait is like an hour. So we'll probably not do that. And I honestly don't really want to do the maze either. I kind of just wanted to come and like look at um, their uh, merchandise and just to like come. And then we can try like Dole Whip. I wonder if their Dole Whip is better than Disneyland's or if it tastes the exact same because I know they use the Dole mix at Disneyland. So I'm just curious about that. They have mango lollipops. I wonder if Vanessa will like that. Passion fruit soft jelly candy. Oh, she'll like that for sure. Pineapple gummy bears. Strawberry gummy bears. Mango gummy bears. Oh my gosh, lychee gummy bears, passion fruit gummy bears. I also want to look at the plush. I'm going to get something for Vanessa. <laughs> Pineapple. But is this the flavor you want? Soft jelly. Yeah. This one is a pineapple soft jelly. Yeah, you want that one? Who said? She said these are good. I'll get one for my sister. Look at this, Papa Bear. Wow. Isn't that cute? That's cute. Ooh, look at these. This looks good. Lemon salt ahi tuna jerky. There's also teriyaki ahi tuna jerky. That sounds interesting. I have not tried that before. Maybe we'll try it. There's a lot of stuff here, you guys. And then they have um, like all the food on this side. So we're going to definitely get Dole Whip because, of course, we have to get that. They have all these different jams and jellies and syrups. More syrups here. Honey. They have so many different oh, ones. Oh, macadamia honey. There's one right here, a little one. Macadamia honey. There's a big one. Which one was the one you said they're out of? Honey butter. Oh, honey butter. Oh, yeah. That would have been good. 
Look at this candle, it's so cute. It's a shape, it's in a pineapple, a wooden, like a wooden bowl. And it really smells good. It smells like pineapple. It's $15. Okay, we're gonna get some Dole Whip. This is what they have. You can get it like this, just in a regular, like a cake comb, $7.50 or in a cup. This one is in a cup with topping, like with diced up pineapples. I'm gonna get this one, the waffle cone, and then it comes with like a piece of pineapple on the side. They have all of these like fancier ones. You can get a pineapple float for $10.75, or you can get the sipper cup float for $12.95. We're also gonna get a bowl of just the cut up pineapple, because we have to try that. And look at this, they have pineapple chili dog combo. So it's a hot dog topped with chili and pineapple. I wonder how that tastes. It sounds like it might be good because, you know, the, the sweet, tangy with the salty. Yeah. Here is my Dole Whip. I got it in a waffle cone and then it comes with a pineapple spear on the side. And then this is the bowl of cut up pineapple. Let's go. So bomb for the birthday girl. Mm. <laughs> this is really good. I don't know, do you think this tastes the same as the Disneyland? Mm -hmm. I would think it would be the same mm -hmm. if they're using the dough mix to make it. Mm -hmm. It kind of just tastes better here though. It's probably just in my mind. It tastes sweeter. Mm -hmm. Doesn't it taste sweet? My sweeter? Was gonna, was I feel like the dough whip at Disneyland is a little sour. I don't know, I could be wrong because I haven't had it in a long time. Mm. They said, you could be a fruit. What fruit will you be? Pineapple. A pineapple. <laughs> wear your crown and wear it proud. Is that what they say? I don't know. Mm. <laughs> Want more? We spent too much money here on souvenirs. I think it was $180. It's expensive. That's the train. Train's like, damn, skip it. <laughs> the train takes you around the whole plantation. Then there's a maze. I think it's really cute, like it's cute for kids. I mean, it's a, cute for adults too, but you know. <laughs> you know what I mean. The wait is long. They said one hour. Imagine if it's summer and it's hot and you're waiting in line. The train goes so slow, that's why. But it just tells you get here early, you know? Yeah, come early. Because even on a Monday, it's packed. Yeah. Nice weather, it cleared up. Happy birthday, Mama. Thank you. You know what is different though? I'll tell you right now what's different between this one and a Disneyland Dole Whip. You guys know the Dole Whips at Disneyland? When they serve it in the cup, it's hollow in the middle because they don't really fill it up all the way. They just go in a circle like that and then it ends up being hollow in the middle. This is not. It's like all the way through. They give you a lot. See? It's all the way. We paid $18 for both of the pineapple chunks and the Dole Whip. It had a little mini one, but... Yeah, okay. Show it to them how small it is. <laughs> See that little hollow part in the middle? So, yeah, Disneyland, it's a big hole? Yeah, that's nothing compared to Disneyland. They should be going like this or something. The whole thing inside at Disneyland is empty. It's only in the outside. So after this, we're going to go to... We're going to try Jenny's Shrimp Truck. I'm excited. I love shrimp, you guys. Oh, my goodness. I love seafood and the garlic shrimp. Oh, yeah. So good. Okay, we just got to Jenny's yeah, Shrimp Truck. It was actually very close to the Dole Plantation. It was like yeah, 10 minutes, right? right? Yeah, 10 minutes, just down one road. But that's what the truck looks like right there. And then they do have like a covered area with some benches. Then there's more benches back here, but it's not covered, but they do have umbrellas. But since it was raining, you know, all the tables are wet. But there's a lot of seating here, actually. Papa Bear got the spicy garlic. It's like spicy, um, yeah, butter garlic, $16. I also, no, I, I didn't also. I got the regular, like number one, the garlic butter. And this was also $16 and you get two scoops of rice. They have like the garlic sauce on top. 
all the shrimp, a little bit of salad, and um, a pineapple. to come to Aulani today since it's kind of like on the way back so here we are at, Aul at Aulani we just parked our car Aulani the weather is really nice can you imagine you're in the lazy river right now huh mm -hmm. so nice it's so pretty I don't think I can ever get over like this view it's so beautiful. I'm gonna go to the store, to the shops, see if there's anything new that I might wanna buy. This backpack is super cute. It's for the Disney Vacation Club lounge fly. It's really cute. And then they have this lounge fly backpack. I don't remember seeing this one last time. It might be new. Got some new t-shirts. This one is cute. I like this one. Kids shirts, super cute. They had this one last time. The sweater is cute. I like it when sweaters have these the slit on the side. That's really cute. I like that. Matching pants, sweatpants. This Olu lounge fly is so cute. I don't know if they had that last time, but this one definitely looks new. Then they have all these like matching clothes, this dress, the men's shirt, and there's a kid's shirt, and the kid's, uh, the little girl's dress. That's so cute. And the spirit jersey. Another backpack. Some plush. This is like a little, a little bag. Oh my gosh, this is really cute. It's a cupcake. I like that. This backpack is super, super cute. That is cute. I think I want to get this. I wanted to get it last time, but I didn't get it. I like that tank top. I have this 2023 ornament. I think I might get that. And then here are the other ears. This one is like a shave ice. That's cute. The blue one. It's like a Christmas one. And this one too.
it's so warm and humid on this side of the island. It's really nice. Guys, guess what? What? I got mama a birthday button. He did. He surprised me. He asked one of the cast members for a <laughs> birthday button. Thank you, Papa Bear. I was surprised. I love it. I'm already wearing it. Um, but I was gonna say, I did buy a couple of things, but this is like the least I've ever spent at a Disney store, huh? Only oh, bought three things. Like 60 bucks, huh? 60 bucks. There wasn't really like too much. There wasn't really anything new or like things wow, that I really you're very wanted. Tall. <laughs> okay, we just stopped at Jollibee. Okay, first we went to Target. I didn't film there because we were just like in and out. I also got my birthday drink from Starbucks. Um, okay. After that, we went to Walgreens. I bought like a bunch of candy and then we went to Don Quixote and I bought more of the like um, car fresheners that we had last time. I bought them from my dad. And then I told Papa Bear, I was like, I need to eat noodles today. And then I know the restaurant that we're going to tonight doesn't have like long noodles. And we saw Jollibee, so like, so then I said, let's get something at Jollibee. Get some spaghetti. Mmm. I have to eat it now. Yeah. Because I don't want to eat it later. It's going to be too close to dinner. Yeah. So here we go. Birthday noodles for a long life. Mix it up. Mix it up. Here. Get your Almost. chicken. And then what's the pie that you got us? Ready? Yeah. Wow, a coconut pineapple pie? We definitely don't have that. I don't know if you guys can see that, but... Yeah. Here we go, birthday noodles. I'll take my thigh. Take your thigh. They put it in these big box? Yeah. Oh, the gravy. Mm-hmm. Want me to open you it? Got, oh, you got thank you. it? Thank you. Mm-hmm. Mm, be careful. Put it here. Yeah. There you go. I was like, that doesn't look stable. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want some spaghetti? No, I'm okay right now. I just want... Oh, spicy. Mm. So good. After this, we're just going to head back to the hotel and rest because I'm tired. And then we have to like freshen up and get ready for dinner. For some reason, the Jollibee here tastes better. And the chicken, because he got spicy chicken with it, it's way spicier. I think you said, but you said it's new, right? Like it's a different yeah. formula or something, different and recipe. Think, and this spaghetti was really warm. Like yeah, really like everything was really fresh. And he also got us this dessert pie, which is coconut pineapple. We don't have this. Limited time. Let's try it. Want to try it right now? Go ahead, mama. Okay, let's try it. And as you know, all of the Jollibee pies are fried. So that's how it looks. It's fried. This is just a marking for like what pie it is. Mmm. Yeah, big chunks of coconut. Alright. Can you get a shot of it? Take another bite and get a shot of that. Mmm. Mm. Yeah, they can see it. Hot. Good, I'm gonna enjoy it. You like that? Mm. <laughs> Try it. It's good. I've never tried any other pie other than the mango. You um, never tried the Lanka pie, banana Lanka? Yeah, that one's good too. Yeah, get the one with the filling, a lot of filling. Oh, it's hot, be careful. <laughs> and it's not a strong, like, coconut flavor. I think it's just right. Wow. Do we have this back at home or no? No, hell no. Huh? Is, that, is that limited time here? Yeah, here. Right. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Not fair. <laughs> Guys, check this out. I left the car and I walked that way, right? So as soon as I walked past the cars in front of us and then I looked up at the at Seafood City and Jollibee, there's a sign right there that says coconut pineapple pie. And I'm like... And then I looked back at you and I'm like, oh man, you're gonna go, you're in for a treat. Because I was trying to, I wasn't trying to get her attention, but I looked back at mama and I'm like, Ooh. I wasn't looking at you. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. It's already almost three o'clock. Yep. I probably, I didn't eat like the whole spaghetti. I, we shared it. I only ate like half of it probably. No, it's, it was just crumbs. So, anyways. 
Yeah, now we're just gonna head back to the hotel and rest. Papa Bear wants to show us the, um, oh wow, yeah, look at that. Damn, I was like, oh my god. It looks exactly like that too, when you get it. <laughs> it's so good, so good, so good. They have a seafood city right here and Jolly Bee's inside. Oh my god, it is boring, you guys, like out of nowhere, what the heck? not rain this hard like our whole trip <laughs> but we're almost there seven more miles of this just gotta be careful and slow Ooh. that was really crazy you guys <laughs> it was only in that like one spot where the rain was falling down yeah. like it was just it was raining really hard in that one spot in the eye, of the storm. eye of the storm that's what papa bear said yep and then a big van drove next to us and um, a bit he, he hit like a puddle. So it splashed all over our car, right? And the windshield was all covered and we couldn't see. <laughs> we couldn't see anything and I was freaking out. I was like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, I can't see. But yeah, okay, I was just being dramatic. Okay, bye. We are getting ready to head out to my birthday dinner. <laughs> Here, you wanna show my outfit? Yeah. Okay. Here's my outfit. Okay, so this dress is really old. I've had it for a long time. It's from Torrid. And then my shoes are from DSW. And then Papa Bear got me this 40th birthday <laughs> sash. And then I'm wearing my pearls that uh, my friend Pono gave. And then I had these earrings already. Mm. And I did my makeup. Mm, beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> okay, your turn. All right, Papa Bear's outfit. Where did you get yeah, that? I got this at uh, it was a uh, online print at Walmart. Uh, nice. Twenty eight bucks, which is cool. I, I like it. it. My uh, beige uh, like cargo cargo pink, shorts. Uh, shorts with my Zori. Can my never. Boa hat and my Guamso as always. He wanted to wear um, pants, but I was like, I think shorts is okay. Everybody yeah. wears shorts here. <laughs> so that's it. We're ready to go. You ready? I'm ready, let's go. Here's a closer look at my makeup. I'm trying these press-on individual lashes for the first time. I think it's made by Kiss. They're called like Kiss Press-On. You don't have to put glue, they're individual lashes. You just put them under your lashes and then you squeeze. And you guys, I do not like them at all. Like they look nice, but for me, they're actually really hard to put on. I'd rather just put on one strip. <laughs> but like, I guess maybe it takes practice. And that's my makeup look. Look at that highlight. Ooh. Just really simple makeup, you guys. So we're having dinner tonight at Hula Grill. This is upstairs from the Sunrise Shack. Okay, it's inside the Outrigger. And I think Dukes is downstairs. We just got seated and look, that's the ocean and the beach right down there. It's, it's so pretty. It's such a pretty view even at night. I love it. So anyways, here's the menu. I don't know what I'm gonna get, but I need to look at the menu. We just got a couple of appetizers. This one is the crab and macadamia nut wontons. This was $19. Mm -hmm. And then this is the mushroom fries, which is a portobello mushroom. It's like battered and deep fried. And then this was $16. And then this one has a sriracha yuzu aioli on top. Ooh. Sounds good. <laughs> okay. So I went with the shrimp carbonara. I think this was around 30 something dollars. I don't remember. 40. 40? Okay. I think 31. I don't know. <laughs> 30 to 40. We'll, and then, we'll double check. Yeah, you got the steak. Kiana? Uh, Kiana, which was 51. $51. Comes with mashed potatoes. Is it like a, and a truffle, truffle butter? butter? Yeah. Right, let's eat. They just brought me a cake. Well, it's a hula pie for my birthday. Here's our receipt for tonight's dinner. Um, okay, so Papa Bear got a beer that was $10. I just got a soda, $4.95. The wontons were $19. The mushroom fries were $16. The shrimp carbonara was $31. And then your steak was 54, and I got the free um, hula pie. So our total was 141.31. That's not too bad. I mean, it's expensive, but like I was, I was thinking, I thought it was gonna be 200. Three, two, one. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. 
Happy birthday, dear mama. Happy birthday to you. Big 40, mama, let's go. Make a wish. Yeah! Hold this. Yeah! Hold, hold this real quick. Thank you. Happy birthday. Thank you.